So don't worry about me if I messed up. Just keep to download because I'm gonna do it again. The, yeah, the music is one of the element that it has a huge capacity, big, tremendous capacity to transform people, to let them think, and, and that's what the record about. The music it doesn't move something in you, it's not music. It's seven notes. That's all we have. How can we make the seven notes make you cry? How we make this seven note make you think? How we make this seven note the sound of airplane, the sound of bombing, the sound of the explosion, the sound of woman crying from her heart. Frahim is a wonderful, amazing, virtuosic musician um, who <laughs> has a certain way of expressing music um, that is kind of unique, actually. You have to kind of feel the heartbreak. You try to put yourself in his shoes because he's got a particular uh, viewpoint in mind of the things he's experienced in his life. It's about the post Iraq war and um, you know no one talks about all these things sure. and he's talking about them through his music and this one really goes deep very sad sad music but uplifting at the same time. When you let go and let the music take you in places you sort of forget about all the microphones and things like that and it's exciting that we're creating something new. It is eight letters written by Iraqi women and children to the United States during the invasion and after that, after math. When I talked to them that time, I said, why do you write these letters? Some of them told me that it's, I need to document it. Some of them said, this is my story. I need them to hear it because they are far away from us. There's one letter uh, written by a, a child, his name Fuad, and he is a disabled uh, teenager. And he wrote in his letter that uh, beautiful day, and I, one of the most beautiful Tishreen, that's by October, and uh, went to have a haircut. And he's a disabled that uh, not really know the ter term of, of of this disease he has. He cannot stand straight. And, uh, and he, when he arrived there, and everybody talking about soccer, this was important between Barcelona and Madrid. You know, and he's happy because he's gonna have a haircut. After five, 10 minutes, the explosion happened or the car bombing was near the, the barbershop in this building. And he was huge massive explosion who is like a lot of people dead a lot of pieces now the problem with this little teenager he cannot run like anybody else he run and fall run and fall and he becomes so close to death because he's surrounded by all these people dead people was pieces, car, uh, fire, and people screaming and crying. Because this is, this is it. He cannot even reach to the safe side of his life. Some people, they don't I realized that a human being has a phenomenal capacity to do harm, huge. And they have a capacity and capability to do very good things. So in the music to me, can we turn it? You know, can we turn to the other side? We're doing something good and, and we make this our world a better place for people to come. And. Uh, and when we put that in context of, does that really make sense? Does that really make difference in, in our world? Yes, it does. Because soon you reached people, you already halfway. <laughs>